What's going on YouTube? GSNO right here. So in today's video I have some important news about the Electra jailbreak for the iOS 11.3.1 and lower. So we're going to talk about this but first I would like to tell you that the design for the website and the Electra has been completed by SIGN in here or Alessandro Carliti which is pretty much the developer or designer behind the website which will look like this probably with a little bit more modifications like what is new in the first beta, what is new in the second one and so on but this is pretty much the new uh, Electra website, not this link in here, but this design in here, which has been completed, which means that we're very close to the release. And as you can see, Electra has a new logo, but this is not really the news I wanted to present. The news I wanted to present are more related to the actual releases. And the first thing I would like to point out is this in here, which has been posted by Pound to Owned. And he says, quote, so Electra for iOS 11.3.1 is now fully complete internally. It only needs a stable initial remount code to get to the public. So what this means is that there is one single step in order to release the Electra, which is something very good. And I think that they're already working on that. So you should rest assured that it will come soon. But aside from that, this individual in here who is actually working close to the Electra team at the development of the Electra for 11.3.1 and lower says, quote, any Electra 11.3.1 leaked build is either fake or malware. Coolstar, Nullpixel and I own it, but no one else does. There is no beta testing program or such. And the reason he says so is because a lot of individuals lately claim that they have the Electra 11.3.1 build that was intended for developers or they have the you know internal beta that is used for testing and they are threatening the Electra team that they will release that. Well, if you see something like that, it's actually fake. There is absolutely no build that has been leaked and there is nothing to leak anyways because only the main developers who are actively working on it have it. So if you see something like that before the release, please do not download that because you're probably either going to mess your device, mess your computer or something else. So do not try anything you see on the internet. And the last piece of news I would like to address is this one coming from the same developer who said, quote, got that DRM for Electra 11.3.1 done. Now the DRM or digital rights management is a protection that will be added to the Electra to prevent the signing services that add, you know, ads and so on like Twitter box and Cyrus and so on from being able to modify the Electra 11.3.1. Now his intention is not to prevent the services from signing it but to prevent them from modifying it like you know adding ads and so on because of course this makes it easier for the Electra team to track down whether the problem is actually in the Electra itself or the problem has been introduced by a third party because the first Electra version did not have a verification or a DRM against this services and of course this services installed ads by injecting dynamic link libraries into the electron you know to load those ads and of course a lot of people had problems and when they told Coolstar or other members from the Electra team about these problems they could not of course figure out whether it's the problem created by that dynamic link library added by the third parties or if it was a bug in the Electra itself. And now they will no longer have this problem since this kind of modifications will be blocked. Anyways, this is pretty much it guys. I'm really happy to see that the Electra website is done. It looks amazing. This is actually a very, very good job from Alessandro Carliti. And I really hope that the Electra team is doing fine and they're not over exhausted at this point. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'm Gio Snow. We'll keep you updated with anything that's going on in the jailbreak community. A little bit more wait, but it will be worth. Thank you for watching. I'm Gio Snow. Peace out.